we are required to find out the reaction of the following beam which is shown for calculating the reactions in a beam considering two dimensional analysis we have three equations sum of forces in x direction sum of forces in y direction and sum of moments about z direction is equals to zero first applying the equation it was given first applying the equation of sum of forces in x direction that is here we have to list the action forces and their reactions since there is no force in x direction so there is zero in the following equation now we have to apply the second equation that is sum of forces in y direction is equals to zero that means net forces acting in y direction has to be zero we know that the reaction a y is positive as we are assuming the positive sign convention upward and the action force this it is minus since it is acting downwards minus 10 lb 10 pounds per fit and there there are 10 fit so each fit counts for 10 pounds and 10 fit counts for 10 multiplied by 10 pounds and the reaction dy is acting in positive direction of y so we get a net equation as we name this as equation number one now we use the third equation sum of moment about the direction now we have to select a point for this equation let's call this as point a b c d for this equation we select the point which gives such a force uh, that is only which gives such an equation that has only one unknown in it so if we apply the equation about point d it will give only one unknown a y and vice versa for a so we apply the equation for point A assuming anti-clockwise direction positive. Now I will tell you the meaning of anti-clockwise direction. Now let's just consider the first force that is 10 pound per fit having a centroid at half of the distance since it is a rectangular force half of the distance of 10 fit is 5 fit 5 fit multiplied by 10 lb per fit multiplied by that intensity so now a negative sign has to be placed because it is rotating in clockwise whereas we considered anti-clockwise as positive and the moment acting again in clockwise direction plus the distance is 30 times dy this equation will give us the reaction dy as dy is equals to 50 pound now we substitute the value of dy in equation 1 gives value of ay as 50 pound That's the required answer. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.